If you are on Red Dead Online, you might start to notice some weird things when it comes to posse names as well as horse names. But this isn't just a visual bug. Rockstar have actually patched Red Dead Online, so they've updated the update 1.32 as of September 24th. And they have made it so custom posse names are no longer visible in Red Dead Online. All players in a posse will now appear publicly as members of their leader's posse. Also, custom horse names are no longer visible in Red Dead Online. All owned horses will now appear publicly as their horse breed. Now that might be a little bit misleading because you can still create your own unique posse names and you can create your own uh, horse names. The problem is only you will be able to see that. So for example, if you create a posse name, um, it'll just show up as posse for everybody else if they want to join. So now if you're looking through the list of posses that you're a member of, you'll just see posse for all of them and you'll have to double check the name of the posse leader to make sure you're picking the right one. For other players, if they are looking on the player menu and they want to check other people's posses, it's just going to come up with their name and that posse. Again, with the horses, uh, you can name the horse so you can see it. But if you come across another player's horse in the game, well, it's just going to say the breed. So, for example, this horse here is my old character and the horse is called Ginger Nuts. But if I look at the trail that it leaves, it's just going to come up Arabian. But why did they do this and why do it now? Well, Tez Fun 2, which is where I actually spotted that this was the change that was made did speculate that maybe this is just Rockstar updating Red Dead Online's profanity filter to align with the community guidelines. And so custom names are disabled until then. So who knows, maybe they'll add this back so that other players can see them. That said, he did go on to say they applied similar changes for GTA Online. Custom arena vehicle names no longer appear to other players since the Chop Shop update, but they do appear to you locally. So that's exactly how they appear on Red Dead Online right now. So to be honest, this is probably a change that we're going to see stick. Honestly, I think this takes a lot of personality away from the game. I mean, I've never I've never looked at someone else's posse name or horse name and went, ha, that's wrong. I've always just thought it was amusing and it did bring a little character to the game, made it a bit unique. And it does make me worry a little bit about GTA 6, considering that Rockstar kind of made a name for itself being a little tongue in cheek. And this seems very kind of, very safe, very sterile, very you know, non-offensive in any way, shape or form, which, you know, it's an adult game. I think things like that should fly. But look, uh, let me know your thoughts on this. Um, also, I'd love to hear your posse names as well as your horse names, because unfortunately we won't be able to share this any other way now going forward. But yeah, please, in the comments, let me know your best posse name that either you have yourself or one that you saw out on the frontier. Really interested to get your feedback on this, people. So definitely let me know below. All right, I'll catch you in the next one.